Welcome back to my channel and if you are new here then thank you for joining us for this video um, I just want to start the video off by saying a massive thank you to everyone that has already subscribed and if you're not subscribed then please click that subscribe button down below and join the family um, just recently over the last couple of weeks um, I've had quite a big influx of subscribers I mean I am still a very teeny tiny fish in the YouTube world with only about 250 subs but to me that is massive and I really appreciate everyone's support so stay tuned because at the end of the video there will be a giveaway for one lucky subscriber or maybe possibly two lucky subscribers so please stay tuned for that and I'll get straight into the video which today is a subscription box haul so instead of doing all of the subscription boxes individually I thought I'd do one big haul um, I've got five different subscription boxes to open um, a couple of them are now last month's box and there's a bit of a story behind that one so I'll, I'll get into that when I get to that specific box but um, I thought I'd share them with you anyway and let you know what um, I think of each box and whether I think it's worth the money. I will put links to all the websites for these subscription boxes in the um, description below and I'll try and find any uh, discount code sorry, for any of the websites because I love a beauty box subscription or... Um, any sort of subscription box, I love getting mail, I love getting surprises through the mail, which I think is what's great about the subscription boxes is that you're never quite sure what you're going to get. It's a great way to try new products. Um, the thing I struggle with is the price, and I think if you're a regular subscriber, it does become quite an expensive habit. So I haven't had a subscription box for ages, and now I've got five to show you. So um, a couple of, well, one in particular I got a really good deal on. But I think if you unsubscribe, they do tend to send you offers um, through emails, little discounts or little extra gifts that you can get for yourself if you resubscribe. And I tend to either um, resubscribe just for that month when I get the extra gift or the special offer or just do a couple of months and then unsubscribe again. Um, so that is the good thing that you're not tied in for a long time if you don't want to be. Um, but they are, can be quite pricey for what they are. Anyway, let's start and I will get in first. I'll start with pink parcel so this isn't one that I've had very much I think I've had maybe one but I was quite impressed with it so um, pink parcel is a subscription box which looks like this when you open it and you get all your womanly monthly needs in there so you get all your towels or tampons whichever you you want whichever you choose to have and you can choose um, a really good selection on there actually what I do like is that they give you this little um, bag you get one of these every month with some of your supplies in um, and I just think that's really cute for keeping in your handbag or in your um, drawer where you're going to keep your products and I just think that's really cute so that you're carrying them around in something quite pretty so you get uh, for now which is the little bag you get for night and for later which have all got your products in whichever you've chosen and then this is the bit that I really like about Pink Parcel, although that is obviously essentials, everyone needs it um, every month. Um, this, however, is the nice little bit. So this is a little something to cheer you up, it says on the box. Um, so it's this is where you get your little beauty treats or your little um, chocolate and drink treats, just to cheer you up for that month. So I'm going to open this up and I've dropped the information leaflet. Just pick that up so that I can tell you exactly what products we've got there's your little leaflet and it just gives you a description about the box this is the after dark edition which is the november one so you should still be able to get this one um and it just tells you a little bit about all the products so let's have a look and see what we've got so first up first thing on the um on the top of the box is this makeup brush which i think is dead cute and to be honest, makeup brushes is one place that I am really lacking in. I am definitely not a makeup expert. I don't wear a lot of makeup. Um, and I think that's just because I don't know what to do with it. So maybe I should watch some YouTube channels um, that specialise in makeup and get into it. But this feels like a really nice brush. And I really like the tip there that's sort of that dyed colour just right on the tip, like a pinky red colour. And then the metal is actually like this iridescent pink colour, which is also dead cute. And this is a brow, I think this is a brow pencil, a uh, pencil, a brow brush. Let's have a look. And this is obviously full sized. 
and this is by Loella Cosmetics which I've not heard of them but the brush feels really nice and this is a brow brush and it's 4 99 for that and I think that's dead nice um, I'll try and use it I'll see if I, what I can do so next product is this which is a full size again and this is an eyeliner by Technique what I do like about that is at the end I don't know if you can see that you've got like a little sharpener there to sharpen your pencil and I don't know about you but I can never find a sharpener for an eyebrow or an eyeliner pencil or a lip liner for that matter whenever I'm looking for one so that's good and you've got your pencil at the one end and then like this smudging um, brush at the other and that's also full size and that's $1.99 so yeah I think that's really good that's definitely something that most people will use although at the moment I think with advent calendars and things there's a lot of eyeliners knocking around and then next thing we've got in here is Dr Stewart's Extraordinarily Good Teas. Now I do love a good cup of tea. Um, let's see what this is. Oh, so it's meant to be a skin purify, a skin purify tea bag. Okay, so what's in this that's going to make it good for my skin? Boost your beauty from within with this blend that includes red clover, nettle, dandelion and lemon to aid the body's natural elimination process and chamomile to soothe inflammation. Okay, so that's perfect for this time of year. There's lots of colds and things going around. Um, I'll definitely be trying that. These are $2.79 for a box of 15. So I do always like that they give you a little drink and it's often something that I haven't tried. Um, so I'm always interested to try, especially new teas. So yeah, I will be giving that one a go. And then your little chocolate for the month is this one, which is a mint chocolate by the looks of it. It looks delicious. Um, the packaging feels really expensive actually. This is, I'm not going to try and sound the name out. I have no idea how you say that. Montezuma's, Montezuma's um, Minted Milk Chocolate with Crunchy Peppermint Mini Bar. Okay, so that sounds really nice. Nice minty chocolate. Love mint chocolate around Christmas time. Like mint, mint matchmakers are just the best, aren't they, at Christmas? And that is 2 59 for 100 grams. We've got a little sample there um i'm not sure oh, 30 grams so that's quite a nice little treat to throw in your handbag okay next up oh i love balance me this is a balance me um what is it congested skin serum so this is going to d diminish blemishes soothe inflammation balance oiliness without over drying so what i like about balance me products is that they're so natural so this is 99% natural and um, it's just a 7 mil uh, sample size but I think that's nice because you get to try it and then if it doesn't suit you then you haven't wasted loads of money or if you do like it then you know that you're gonna be happy to spend the full price on it before you buy it next up we have skin and co Roma truffle therapy whipped cleansing cream that sounds interesting um, whipped cleansing cream. I've never used a whipped cleansing cream before. And this is a highly concentrated cleanser formulated to renew dry and dull skin while providing extra care to sensitive skin. So that's good. And that's a 30ml product, so that's quite good. And that is £30 for 150ml normally. And I didn't tell you how much the Balance Me was, did I? The Balance Me uh, skin serum is £16 for 15ml. So that's quite pricey for a little product and then the last thing we've got I absolutely love face masks so this is the skin republic brighten hydrate face mask and this is 5.49 for one of these oh it's a limited edition one and um, it's radiance boosting one so yeah I really like um especially the sheet ones so much easier than your normal face mask less messy so yeah, there's all your products for this month in Pink Parcel. And I really like that. I really like Pink Parcel's um, little products that they've put in. I think you get a good mixture of um, makeup, of skincare. I like the little chocolate and tea or drink treat that they send you. Um, it's usually quite nice. But I don't use a lot of feminine products, so it's not a box that I have every month. But I do think it's a good box, especially for the price. I think it's quite a good box. 
because you can spend a lot on feminine products, can't you? Um, the next subscription box that I've got is a completely new one. I've never had one of these before and it's mask time. And one of my subscribers actually asked for a mask um, subscription box. So I had a look into it and there weren't that many actually, um, which is surprising with how popular face masks are at the moment. But I saw mask time and it did look quite good and there were two options and I think I went for the sort of the starter option um just where you get four face masks I think which I think is about 10 pounds but I'll put the information below um and this is what it looks like when you open it up so it's quite nicely packaged I quite like the plain brown box I think that's nice and then it's quite bright inside it just says ready, ready set glow and I love the little tissue paper look how sparkly that is so pretty so it says this box was handpicked just for you thank you for being part of the mass time family so i'm just going to open it up and we're going to see what we've got and this is one where i think i've got october's box um, i did order it right at the end of october so i was expecting to get november's box but yeah they've sent me october's box which isn't a big deal really um doesn't really matter with face masks and i know like the other subscription boxes are usually themed to the time of year and this one does look themed because it says hello beautiful um so these are obviously halloween face masks or halloween themed face masks but i don't think that's going to really matter too much so you get this little card with a little bit of a blurb on it just about your box and then you get this card which has got all the details about your face masks on and it's also got some little tips on there which is always handy so let's dig in and see what masks we've got. So this looks cool. This is Mystic Potion Candy Mask. How cute does that look? And this is definitely a Korean, I would say. Obviously, it's got all the writing on that. And I thought by the look of the packet that it was just going to be like a normal face mask. But it looks like it is a sheet mask because you've got the little face in the corner there but let's because this is um one of the korean ones i would say it's all in korean i mean you can i've had them before where i've bought them um from cheaper websites and they've come without any instructions and you can get google translate on your phone and just hover it over and it translates it for you so you can work out how long you need to leave it on and what you're meant to do with it so that's a good tip if you haven't got any instructions but mass time have given us some instructions and the price for this one is three pounds and it says get a moisturizing punch for this mystic potion of aloe vera extract lavender rosemary and camilla leaf extract tea tree helps with healing irritation and blemishes while ceramide and sage help with battling fine lines and wrinkles and i definitely need help there so that's dead cute i like that one i like that one a lot and that one's three pounds and then we've got another lovely Halloween themed one or at least autumn themed one with this pumpkin one and this is from Mediheal and this is also worth three pounds and I think this is another sheet mask I'm not sure if they're all sheet masks actually yeah this is a sheet mask um, and this one um, is going to provide moisture and elasticity to dull tired skin so that sounds good Provides deep nourishing care, leaving your skin glowing and clear. So that is good. We always need a bit of hydration in the winter time. This one looks quite cute. Look at this. And this is a, a jelly sheet mask, which I don't think I've used a jelly one before. That looks dead cute. And that is in strawberry scent. And this one is infused with strawberry essence. Oh, and it has the face on the mask. So I always get excited when you see like... Um, you know, like the Disney ones, I got dead excited when I saw the Mad Beauty Disney ones and I thought I was going to get the princess face on the sheet and then it turns out it's just like a printed pattern. So it is quite pretty, but I do love it when you get like a proper full on face. I've used some face ink ones, which um, is the beauty end of the nails ink range. And I got some last Christmas and I had reindeers on. It is so cute. And my little girl absolutely loves it when I put them on. She thinks it's hilarious. So yeah, this one is a jelly type one and it's full of vitamin C, perfect to balance out oily skin while nourishing and revitalising. It's also effective in healing acne scars and pigmentation. So that's, that's good. I've not seen 
um, one that's good for scarring before. And then the last one, sorry, that one was worth £4. This one is the Real Cotton Pumpkin Mask and this is £3. And this is a 100% cotton sheet mask infused with essence from pumpkin, which is packed with fruit enzymes, uh, magnolia, white sandalwood, ginseng, offering calming and moisturising properties, wake up to firmer, smoother skin. So another one that I think will suit me really well. So you get four face masks in this one. They do do a bigger box where you can get a lot more, but I have loads of face masks. I do use a lot, but um, as it was a new box and I wasn't sure what I was going to get, I thought I would just trial it with the smaller one. But actually, I'm, I really like those. And I love that they're all Korean face masks. Um, they're all a bit different, a little bit quirky, especially sort of the the candy one and the, um, the jelly one. The jelly one sounds incredible. I'm not sure what that's going to be like. So yeah, I quite like that box. I'm quite impressed. And I'll let you know how I'll get on with the, um, the face uh, masks. I have used a couple of Korean face masks before um, and always been quite impressed with them. So yeah, I'm looking forward to using those. The next box I am really excited to open and it is the November Glossy Box. So I haven't had Glossy Box since um, the summer, I think was the last time I had Glossy Box. Um, and I always rate Glossy Box. I think they deliver some really good products. Um, it's always really prettily packaged. And I think for the money, it's probably one of the best beauty subscription boxes you can get, especially at the lower end of the budget. And it always comes beautifully wrapped. And November's box seems like it's going to be amazing. So I'm going to start off with the first thing that's in here. And this is the Style London Little Eyeshadow Palette. And just look at these colours. Oh, might help if I took the seal off. I didn't realise it had got a little seal on it. But I have seen this on um, on like a little sneak peek on their Instagram, I think. And this, I mean, just look at those colours. So you've got a couple of mattes and then some more shimmery, glittery ones. I think this is a really good basic nude palette that everyone can use, especially around this time of year. And all these are real autumnal colours. Um, like I say, I'm not a massive makeup wearer really, but I think this is just the sort of thing that could kickstart my habit of <laughs> my makeup habit because I just think that looks pretty darn good. And that is worth £9.99. So really quite affordable as well for nine colours. I think that's really good. So really liking that one. And next up we've got the Ico Fat Liquid Eyeliner in black. And this is another full size, so that's two full size products already, and that is worth sixteen pounds. That's quite—is that me or is that quite pricey for a, a liner? I mean, it's like a little felt tip. It's quite thick, um, and it says dramatic long wear, so that's good. I suppose party season's coming up, and if you're going to go for a dramatic eye, that would be really good. Next up, we have Palmer's Cocoa Butter. And this is the original solid formula. So this is just a deluxe mini size, which is worth £1.99. The full size at 100 grams would be £4.15. Now, I've used a lot of the um, Palmer's Cocoa Butter products in the past. I always find them really good. Really affordable brand, but I think they are a really good brand as well. Um, soothes, marks and tones skin. Relieves rough, dry skin for 24 moisture. Um, so yeah, it's just like a little, a little solid in there, and I think that'd be really good for really dry, chapped areas, especially in winter when all your skin gets dry. Um, but really good for if you've got really chapped lips or really like dry elbows or knees, anywhere that gets really dry. So yeah, ideal for deep moisturisation, including overnight treatments. That's a good idea, rubbing it on overnight. Then we have, oh, what's this? Context Microderm Regenerator. Oh, what's this? This is a deluxe mini. It's a 30ml and that's worth £6.50. The full size is 120ml, which is worth £26.70. And this is a 2 in 1 cleanser. So it's got microdermabrasion crystals to gently exfoliate, polish, and purify, and then powerful antioxidants to protect cells and fight free radical damage to leave your skin feeling soft and hydrated. 
and what's more it's cruelty and fragrance free so if you've got sensitive skin this would be great there's no added fragrance in it and um i'm always happy to hear that a product is cruelty free and yeah you can just see the little exfoliating beads in there yeah that looks good again another product that you really need this time of year um, with the weather um, we've also got this month a little fragrance sample so this is just like a little extra freebie mine is the Chloe which is a powdery rose feminine natural scent so yeah I'll, I'll do a little spray actually I love these um, some people are always a bit disappointed by these ones but this has got a little spray on which is good I really like them for um, just chucking in my handbag. So sometimes, you know, when you're really busy in the morning, you run out of the house and you think, oh, I've got no perfume on. I've usually got a couple of these lying about in my um, handbag, so I can always put a little fragrance on. That actually smells quite nice. Um, and a 30 ml of this would be £47. So, yeah, if you wanted... I always think this is good as well. It gives you an idea of what the scents are, and then if you really like it, you can put it on your Christmas list. And then the last product is the best product in this box, by my in my opinion, anyway. And it is the Huda Beauty Liquid Matte Lipstick. So I love um, a matte lip, um, and this looks just my sort of colour. So it looks quite nude in the packet. It is the shade Venus, and this is a full size worth eighteen pound. So I think in this box you would definitely get your money's worth. You get three full-size products and two deluxe minis plus your little extra fragrance so I think that's a really good um really good box this month and yeah that is that is so the sort of colour that I've been wearing at the moment I've really got into quite nude colours um this autumn and I'm gonna absolutely love that yeah I think that's a brilliant product and it just says that it's lightweight, long wearing, glides on and intensifies to set as a matte transfer free finish. So yeah, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. But it looks amazing. Um, looks a really good lipstick. I mean, £18 a good price, isn't it, for something in your beauty subscription box. And um, I'm excited to see what comes in December's glossy box. Because I think, especially at this time of the year, um, it's usually the time when people sort of cancel their subscription boxes because obviously it's Christmas, money's a bit tight, everyone's spending their money elsewhere so I always think that subscription boxes pull their best products out of the bag at this time of year to try and keep people um, interested, keep people subscribed so yeah I'm definitely going to hold out for December's box and glossy box. And next up is the big one so I have these two big boxes from Birchbox. So I haven't had a Birchbox for an absolute age. Um, and I'll tell you why, because I didn't think they were worth it. You used to get a lot of little products, um, and I was quite disappointed a couple of times that I'd got repeat products. So I hadn't had one for ages. Um, and then I had an email from them saying, if you buy October's box, we will give you two extra boxes from our previous box ranges um, for free. So I was getting three boxes for the price of one. And because I hadn't had a box for so long, I thought that would be great because I'll get two boxes that I definitely have, I haven't had, so I won't get any duplicates. So I ordered, and it took them a while to get me one because first they sent it to my old address, um, so I had to get that changed. So then they sent me out some new new boxes, and what happened then was when it arrived, I got really excited. I opened the box, and inside. I had two of the October boxes. Now, I didn't really want two the same. I thought I would be getting one October box and two additional boxes. So I did get this one, which I was really excited to see, especially as it's in a little tin, um, but I'd got another October box. So I emailed them just to say, um, thank you for sending me my boxes because obviously we'd had them mixed up with the address. Unfortunately, I've got two of the October boxes, which isn't what I signed up for. I thought I was getting two different boxes, two old boxes. And I have to say, the Birchbox customer service has been brilliant. Not only did they send me out my boxes when they got sent to the wrong address, but 
they then said with the duplicate box keep that extra box we'll send you two more out so i've ended up with five birch boxes for the price of one and their customer service i cannot fault it was really really good unfortunately when my next two boxes came i had another one of these which i haven't complained again obviously because i've now got five boxes um i did get one different one so um yeah i got five boxes for the price of one although i did get two duplicates but i thought well what better way to do a giveaway than to give away two of these lovely little birch boxes and i will also throw in a couple of goodies from myself in with these boxes because like i say the birch boxes although they are lovely this one well these two actually in particular i really like the design of them and that one feels quite heavy so i'm looking forward to seeing what's in the october box um but i do think they're a bit sparse um, in comparison to like glossy box i think you get better products in glossy box usually so i will be giving these away so if you want to enter the giveaway to win a little um birch box plus a few goodies from myself um then all you need to do is make sure you subscribe to my channel um, please like the video and then in the comments below can you just I tell you what tell me if money was no object what you'd ask for for Christmas this year so I will have a glance through I always reply to everyone's comments anyone who comments on my video always gets um, a reply from me so um, yeah tell me what you would ask for for Christmas this year if money was no object and we'll do a little giveaway um yeah so let's open my birch boxes anyway so i'll start off with the october one so obviously that's the latest one and it is a really nice box and what i like about these as well is that unlike glossy box which i never sort of reuse i've seen people sort of stack these and stick them together and use them as little drawers i mean they're perfect for your little products like this or for makeup brushes or jewelry so yeah it is good i do quite like the design and in this one we have got some really nice products so i've got a little perfume sample again which i love these little perfume samples and this is a dupe for woman i never knew dupe did um women's fragrance so maybe that's just me being a bit dense but oh actually that smells really nice so we've got another little perfume sample and that will be going straight in my handbag we have also got from model co a cream rouge so this is a full size good size product in the color just peachy and they say it's a two-in-one formula so you can use it on your cheeks or your lips so gosh i never thought about using it on my lips but that is a really nice red color perfect for christmas um yeah tap on the apples of your cheeks smooth the excess onto your lips and it will provide a tint without drying your skin out so yeah that's nice i mean i'm not one for blush but now i know i could possibly use it on my lips that might be a good one and that's worth 14 pounds so already actually already we're off to a good start maybe birch box has done a little turnaround and i'm going to be impressed this time with the products next up we have this which is an amica soul food nourishing hair mask and how much is in there that's a little 20 ml product so depending on your hair will depend on how many uses you get out of that one but the full size is 20 pounds and yeah you just put it on it's a mask it will intensely hydrate repair damage still frayed ends so that's good yeah i like a hair mask i do um have to blow dry straight my hair quite a lot so the ends especially get really dry and raggedy so I'll give that a go and try that and see what it's like see what it smells like actually take the little seal off oh that smells really nice i'm not sure what it is i'm not very good at describing scents but that does smell nice and next up we have another eyeliner see what i mean about eyeliners this is like the third one now so this is the Lord and Berry Magic... Oh, no, it's not an eyeliner. It says it's a brow pencil. That looks really dark for a brow pencil. Oh, it is brown. Okay, I will definitely use that then. It's a brow pencil. 
Um, so it's not full size because in the picture the full size one has the little um, brow brush on the end. But a full size one is worth £15 and this is by um, Lord and Berry. So yeah, definitely use brow pencil. Wow, this is what was making the box heavy. So this is your Daily Concepts Multifunctional Soap Sponge Charcoal. I have not used one of these before. So this is a multifunctional charcoal soap sponge. Combines detoxifying charcoal cleanser with a gentle exfoliating sponge so you can skip, skip a step in your skincare routine. And that is worth £6 and that is full size. So yeah, we've got... Actually, the last product is also full size. So we've got three full size products in this box. So I'm quite impressed with that. The last one is this, which is another face mask. And this is the Thermotherapy Gold Foil Face Mask with Hyaluronic Acid. And this is worth £5.95. sorry. And this is going to improve elasticity, reduce fine lines and boost glow. So yeah, love a face mask. So yeah, I'm quite impressed with that one. That's... um. That's a good one from Birchbox. In comparison to ones that I've had in the past and I've been quite disappointed with, I'm quite happy with that one. I think they're really good products. You've also got a little um, voucher for 43 prints. So that's good. So I'll pop that one away. So one of you lucky people could be winning one of those. And then this, I'll do this one next which is this lovely little tin and I love a tin you can reuse these for so many things um, you can even use it sort of in a wrap, as wrapping for a gift and this one is in collaboration with Wittard at Chelsea and it was for Birchbox's fifth birthday in June so first off you have some Wittard tea love tea and in here we've got how many have we got? Three, three tea bags. Three little tea bags. One is lemon and ginger, one is Earl Grey, and one is mango and bergamot. So three little tea bags. I have bought things from um, Wittards in the past. Really nice brand, really lovely products. And you also get a little voucher in there. I'm buying some more tea. Pop that away. And then um, let's have a look what else we've got in here. So this is the first one and this is number four and it's a smoothing balm. And this is worth, well, I think the full size is £24.50. Um, it doesn't tell you how much the full size items are, but this is just a sample because it says not for resale on it so it's definitely sample size it is 30 mils though and it is just for your hair to re restore softness protects against humidity and heat damage and minimize frizz so yeah definitely something i will use especially on the ends of my hair and in winter i think with being in the central heating and then going out into the cold and coming back it definitely does dry out your hair and this is for um, damp hair. So you put it on your hair while it's damp and then either let it air dry or um, blow dry it. What is this in this little packet? This is an Ella Eden eyeshadow. That's a really nice colour actually. So this is in the colour, the colours on the book. It doesn't tell me which one it is. It's either Faith or Julia. Oh, it's Julia. It's right there in Big massive letters, but I couldn't see it. Yeah, so this is really nice little um, eyeshadow. This is full size and it is worth £12.99. That's quite a good product to get, good size. I cannot get into it to look at it, but it looks like a lovely, quite um, champagne-y, nudie colour, which I think will be nice. Um, maybe especially with some of those ones that I just got in a glossy box. Uh, the next one that we've got is the... Polar Velvety Sun Fluid Face and Body. I'd imagine this is like a sun cream. Oh, it's a sunscreen, which is obviously just like a, a moisturising lotion as well. And it's factor 30, so that's a good, good factor. And there's some sun cream smells, so I'll just remind you of holiday. I 
I have used Polar products before. I think I've had them in subscription boxes before. They've always been quite nice products. Um, hasn't got a massive scent. It does smell quite sun creamy. That's quite a nice product. And we've got a Lord and Berry strobing pencil is our next item. Looks like quite a nice colour. Um, yeah, really like light champagne colour that one. And that is um the full size is £14. This is obviously just like a little sample size. And then our last teeny tiny sample is the Benefit Pore Pore Professional Pearl Primer. Soft radiance face primer to minimise the look of pores. Now I really wanted to try this actually. I had a really nice um under eye sort of cream primer from Benefit ages and ages and ages ago which I loved but they've stopped doing it so I was eyeing up the professional range and thinking about trying it but it's quite pricey so I'm glad I've got a little sample now of one so I can just give it a go but it is an absolutely teeny tiny sample it is only three mil and the full size is £27.50 which for me that's quite expensive for a, a, a primer I'm not like I said I'm not a makeup person really so but it is meant to be really good, so I will give that a go. And then, what else have we got in here? We've got a little thank you for the fifth birthday, and um, yeah, it's just some discount codes for you. Um, so yeah, not a bad box that one. Um, quite a few really small products, but I do like the tin, and I do love Wittard tea. So one of you lucky people could be winning one of those and then my last box is this really pretty pastel one and this isn't a drawer and most of the birch boxes are a drawer but this one's actually a box and well you've actually got quite a few decent sized products in this one so let's have a look find out which box this is this was the july box okay quite a lot of card in this one so there's a 25 percent off Generator hostels for when you're adventuring, and then oh, that's one of the products. Let's see what else. That's just telling you about the birch box shop, and then here's the little card to say what we've got in in there. And I'd picked this up thinking it was like an information leaflet, but it's not. It is a nose patch. So it is for blackheads. So it's just a little. Cleanser. I imagine it's just one of those little strip things that you put on your nose and then peel off, which are always quite satisfying, aren't they? And the full size one of these is £13.90, but it doesn't say that it's full size, so I imagine it's just one patch and you would normally get a few patches. Um, yeah, great for when you want to just give your nose a good clean, get rid of all the dirt and grime that builds up in the pores on your nose. So yeah, that's a good, good little product. Next up we have this, which is a blush in the shade Paradise by Mana Kadar, I want to say. I'm not a makeup expert. Um, yeah, not a massive blush fan, so I might be giving this one away because, like I said before, I don't really use blush. Um, but it does say it can be used on the cheeks and the eyes to add a pop of colour. Just look like a nice um, ready colour again. And that is a full size and it's worth £15. So that's quite a good price. We have, I now have a second one of these, which is the Balance Me Congested Skin Serum. And this is um, worth £16 if it's full size. But this obviously is just a sample size. I might be giving that away because I've got two of those now. But yeah, I do like the Balance Me. It's a good, um, good brand. Then we have this which is a shower scrub by what's in it for me and it says uplifting orange and jasmine flower extracts that linger on your skin sweet almond oil to nourish and prevent dryness plus it gently scrubs away dull dead skin cells with fragments of gritty walnut shells okay so it's got a natural exfoliant in which is always good let's have a little smell oh it does smell really nice actually and you can see the little bits of walnut in it that smells really good. And that is a 50ml, which is quite a good size. Obviously just a sample again. Um, but the full size is worth £7. 
What I do like um, about the glossy box compared to the birch box is that even if it's a sample size, it tells you how much your sample size is worth. Whereas on birch box, it will only give you the price of the um, full size item. And I can't, can't get the lid back on that one. Leave that there. Yeah, so I like that because you can easily see on the glossy box information sheet how much your products are worth, um, even for the size that they are of the samples, and work out whether your box has been good or not. What is this? Is this a dry shampoo? Okay, this is a dry shampoo with oat milk for all hair types. And this uh, full size would be £9, and it's by a brand called Cloran. Cloran. Made with softening oat milk extracts, ultra fine powder spray sets up oil and sweat without leaving any residue behind. So this might be handy just to keep in your in your bag, especially like your gym bag um, after the gym, or um, if you're at work and you know you're going straight out after work and you want to just give your hair a little refresh. That could be a good little product for that. Hello. We'll try again tomorrow. Okay, we'll try again tomorrow. Give me a kiss. Gotta edit you out my video now. <laughs> Chase, shut the door properly, please. Okay. See you later. Being a mum, you never get five minutes peace, do you? Hey ho. Anyway, that's all my boxes. So yeah, um, I think Birch Box has impressed me because I've got five boxes for the price of one. Um, if I'd have just got the October box though, I think that is a really good box. Like I said, this, the July one, not so great. Um, I love the tin with the Wittard one, but again, the products weren't amazing. Um, not compared to like the glossy box ones. Um, I really like Pink Parcel, especially maybe if you're a younger girl, um, sort of late teens. I think that would be a really nice one to to get and I am excited about the mass time ones I really like that and I think that's one that I might actually um, buy again so yeah don't forget to subscribe and then you will be entered into the giveaway and I will announce it on YouTube so stay tuned subscribe click the notification bell so that you know when I'm uploading and you will then know when the winner is announced and yeah thanks for all your support guys I hope you enjoyed the video see you again soon for another video thanks bye